this video is about an inspiration towards taking on a new challenge and of course gratitude after succeeding in that challenge well this semester i happened to be in a position where i was offered a course that is outside my area of expertise a cyber security subject in the major of cyber security called database security systems well actually this is the first time this course was offered in jamia hafar al -Badin. in fact it would be the first time to be offered in many universities across Saudi Arabia because it has been a new subject being introduced by the Ministry of Education in Saudi Arabia. And this course actually provides knowledge, skills and abilities to manage, use and protect database systems. It covers database security issues such as inferences, aggregation, injection, hashing, encryption, data corruption, unauthorized access and database access control. When I was first approached with this course, actually I had to sit down and think twice. Should I take it or choose the area that I, that I am used to? So I told myself, I don't run away from challenges because I believe challenges are meant to build you up, not to destroy you. If it doesn't scare you, that means it's not beneficial for you. But if it scares you, that means go for it because you would eventually learn or get something out of that. So I took this subject and of course with dua and hard work, I was able to succeed it in actually teaching the subject so uh, it's an exciting journey for me and for the students as well because it has also become a source of inspiration to them seeing me from computer science uh, you know uh, jumping into cyber security department taking the subject and of course at the end of the day uh, we completed the subject and they had some projects which I'm going to take you through their presentations and I hope it's going to excite you of what we are able to do so far enjoy users to register login and managing their accounts online. The main focus was implementing security features such as encryption use of remote registering and activity login to keep the system safe and real. We also love challenges and we finished that project in only one week and we are doing uh, testing and reviewing uh, in only three days. Second, we used AES encryption after we implemented the system and applied all the security measures. Now it's the time for testing and validation. While building uh, the system, we applied real world uh, techniques like encryption and through based uh, access. The second one is medical uh, records. Contain encrypted uh, diagnosis and you can see the medical history and uh, the receptionist can see it like patient and medical history, encrypted medical data. The last one, authorized decryption. Author now we talk about backup and recovery strategy. First one is regular backup uh, Regular backup. Grant statements carefully define what each user role can access. The actions run into database. On demo, show the full cycle of using the banking system securely. I will talk about uh, data schema. So, uh, technique steps we took to secure our database, such as password hashing, encrypting, and access control. Then our is a challenge. Some challenge we incorrected during the project we uh, planning to find grind RBAC rules using only SQL. Detection and prevention system or database. What is the goal? Automatically detect failed login attempt to protect user accounts. As you can see after after the failed login attempt, insert it using the command. What is the action? The action is it will be executed immediately after a failed login attempt. It's updated to one meaning the uh, admin account is blocked. Now we can see the user admin is looking out after three login within one hour detection after after enabling my school login detection field the logins system system architecture 
and uh, this uh, diagram shows you how a system architecture is built. The image shows the SQL code for creating tables, roles, permission, roles, permission, and seeding them with the uh, code. I hope we talk and e-commerce. Our project aims to develop a secure e-commerce platform using MySQL. It's designed to protect customer data and prevent fraud and ensure safe online transactions. Ensuring that all operations are conducted securely. Are stored security in the encrypted format for both businesses and customers. Advanced security mechanism. Customer data protection for platform with secure payments. So, this platform includes a well-structured database protection against SQL injection attacks, encryption of sensitive payment data using hashing, and smart monitoring tools. Secure and enrich database SQL injection, protecting assay secure injection attacks. Uh, secure and cloud information with hashing. Three tables we talk about. So this project demonstrates how an e-commerce platform can be made more secure. Our project is called uh, a secure online banking system. Uh, so we made uh, a safe uh, system to protect users' accounts, uh, transactions, and logs. We used AES uh, encryption to encrypt account balances before storing them. Only users with the correct. Well, I hope you and you have enjoyed the presentation so far. Amazing experience, amazing projects, exciting semester to me and to the students. And now it's time for feedbacks because I would like to take their feedbacks, and I would like you to see. And let's go and see what they have, what is their experience, and what they have to say about the subject. And um, I hope uh, to, uh, it has impacted their lives, not only about the subject, but also in general about My life itself. Ahmed, Thank you. Group two, and I would like to talk about the course that uh, taught by Dr. Ahmed. Dr. Ahmed is, uh, I don't need to say anything. Dr. Ahmed, his reputation precedes him. I see him as a more of a mentor, more than a teacher because of the, uh, the advice that he gives us. Oh, okay. Not just the uh, teachers, the, the uh, lectures and goals. He also gives us lecture, uh, lectures about life and advices. And he's actually uh, one of the few teachers that I see. And every time I see his name, I just feel uh, relieved because I know this, uh, this subject will be smooth as butter. So no need to say anything more. Uh, I'm glad that Dr. Ahmed taught me this course, uh, Database Security. We have learned many things uh, in this course and our, in our life. Uh, something that I didn't like in this course, which is the doctor was very, very, very good. That's a, if you don't find any uh, negative things to talk about someone, for me, at least this is uh, a not good thing because uh, we all have uh, negative uh, sides or I don't know what you call it, but I'm glad, wallah, very glad that you taught me yourself, doctor, and you taught me many things in my life before this course. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I would like to thank uh, Dr. Ah Dr. Ahmed and uh, actually all students would like to thank him and uh, appreciate him for uh, his kindness and uh, the information uh, that uh, he teach us. Actually, this course is, was uh, very uh, enjoyable and uh, very uh, a great uh, course. It's, uh, it's the first uh, students at uh, section that uh, take this course and uh, it was a very, uh, very fun course actually and uh, it's uh, very good for uh, the much of the information that we have and uh, before I end, uh, I would like to thank uh, Dr. Ahmed again because uh, he was very patient with us and uh, even if we are not uh, very good students he was patient and uh, he was kind actually. He was uh, told us and uh, learning us even if we not that good, but he will make us good in the future, inshallah. First, I want to thank uh, Dr. Ahmed Arbaharwana for uh, teaching us uh, this course. Uh, it was a very good uh, experience uh, from uh, the Dr. Ahmed Harwana. Uh, also, uh, he was not uh, want to take, uh, there is no one uh, want to take this course and they assigned this course to him. This uh, consider a big uh, challenge uh, and he accept uh, that challenge and
I feel motivated uh, every time I enter your class yes, because uh, you start uh, always uh, the motivational talk, you know. Uh, and uh, that's it. Thank you. Thank you too. Thank you all the best. Uh, his uh, dedication and uh, supportness help us uh, to get the benefits from, the, from this uh, course. And also, I want to mention one thing about uh, Corona that he takes uh, the challenges. He, even uh, if this, uh, even this uh, course. His uh, first uh, time to take in the security uh, field, uh, his major uh, studying, uh, his major teaching about the computer science and the programming. Uh, he always take this, uh, takes the challenges and I want to advise him to keep it that way. And uh, thank you for the uh, support and end up with uh, presenting our project. Dr. Ahmed Abu Haruna, uh, I want to thank him very much uh, about his way for uh, Hearing us, it's so simple, and he don't have the, like uh, a shield between us, between the student and the teacher. There's no anything. If you want to ask him, you will ask him, and you have uh, your full uh, list. And thank you very much. Wassalamu alaikum warahmatullahi First, thank to God to see you and uh, to teach us about uh, database security. Uh, we teach about SQL injection. This is the important thing in the course and how to protect our data in the database. And uh, the class was flexible and good. And uh, thank you. We faced a lot of challenges in our project and we yes. solved it, alhamdulillah. Yes. Uh, also, we have uh, some advices from uh, our doctor. We will. Uh, do it in the future, inshallah. We gain a lot of uh, things in this course, uh, like uh, the way of, uh, of your teaching is uh, uh, like uh, different from uh, the doctors. Yes. Uh, before the course started, I was uncomfortable and I feel afraid about this uh, course in uh, uh, database security. I think it will be hard. I think it will be not easy. Then when uh, Dr. Uh, Ahmed Abu Haruna came to us and teaching us well from the first lecture. I feel free. I feel everything will be great with this doctor. So thank God to have you, Dr. Harona. And uh, a good thing from Dr. Harona is uh, uh, he he's, uh, he is give us a time, give us time and feel free to ask him anything about our lecture. So thank you, Dr. Harona. learned a lot from this uh, course and security measures and countermeasures. Thanks to Dr. Abu Harona. Uh, I've been with uh, Dr. Ahmed Harona for the past years. I've studied with him like three lectures or three courses. Alhamdulillah, uh, he was so good and if anything I want from him, I can ask him and he will tell me uh, freely and Alhamdulillah. Well, I want to thank uh, Dr. Ahmed Abu Harona to study to studying us uh, the whole term and uh, we feel uh, comfortable with him and uh, he is the best doctor ever and thank you doctor uh, first of all i want uh, to thank uh, dr ahmed for this uh, great course and uh, what he did for us uh, he teach us uh, this course uh, excellent and uh, we learn a lot of things from him Thank you. I studied with Ahmed Harona in two courses, Java and uh, Database Security, and he was a very good uh, uh, doctor and teacher instructor who, who taught us a lot of things in these courses. And thank you. This is the first time I uh, study with Dr. Ahmed Harona, and uh, it's uh, a new experience and I want to thank Dr. Ahmed Harona because it's the first time to study this subject and uh, something I want to uh, thank him for because he has uh, let us do the work, especially in the lab and uh, I'm really grateful for that. Thank you. Uh, thank you. Uh, thanks Dr. Ahmed Abu Harona for uh, this course. Learn a lot of things from him and uh, at lab, at uh, lecture, he give us all the attention for every student to become a strong man or become a, a cyber security st uh, employee. And thank you, Dr. Abaron. And uh, the first, I was scared. But uh, <laughs> Dr. Ahmed, yes, I enjoyed. Uh, with you, he, he was uh, very good. Alhamdulillah. Oh, thank you, Victor. Oh, let me thank the doctor first, uh, uh, Dr. Ahmed. 
Uh, he taught us so much uh, in this course and he did the best, utmost job at doing so. And then I want to thank my friends who worked with me on this project. Uh, the project made us not uh, only better at this course, but also made us closer to each other. Um, and if I'm going to talk about Dr. Ahmed and not conclude it, <laughs> I will, this video will be really, really long. So thank you Dr. Ahmed for first teaching us and second being a mentor in our lives and give us so much lessons outside of this course. Just like well, I'm, uh, I'm touched thank you so much and humbled thank you, thank you. Uh, by the feedbacks of this students. Um, thank you all. Um, actually, uh, this wouldn't have been uh, exciting without your support as well because you have cooperated throughout the subject. I am very proud of you and inshallah you are going to achieve a lot of great things and please take the knowledge, take the experiences and please share it with others inshallah uh, because if you are able to change one person's life, the other one would change another one's life and then the world would be better. Uh, right, all the best guys and looking forward to new challenges and I wish you all the best. Allahumma lakal hamd for everything Allah has helped me throughout. Barakah guidance and see you again. Ma'asalama. Goodbye.